a 21st century whore. <laughs> I almost hit a bunny rabbit again. Why, bunnies? Why? Why are you doing this to me? I didn't. Thank gosh. I almost destroyed my life hitting an animal in my car. Oh my gosh. How even long ago was that? Every time I walk back in my backyard to the bunny's grave, um, cause I, of course I took it with me. It wasn't even like a wild rabbit. It was like clearly someone's pet rabbit that got out, but nobody claimed it. And several people claimed to know it. So I know I gave them the chance to get their bunny rabbit back to bury it if they wanted to. And they didn't get a hold of me. So it had been out for like a year previously and the poor little poor little gal or guy ran across the road while I was driving and did one of those like I'm gonna run across the road but then I'm gonna be like and first time in my life I've ever hit anything. I've been driving for 15 years so yeah, yeah, that was quite a shock. And I bawled my eyes out to the point where somebody found me on the side of the road and um, put out a Facebook, <laughs> put out a Facebook message. It was Jonathan guy. Thanks, Jonathan. I appreciate that. I really do. You know, I was very messed up. I have never killed an animal like that in my life and I was really messed up on the side of the road after that oh it died fairly quickly thank gosh I mean if it had been suffering I don't know what I would have done run over it again I really don't know what can you do and it was just really messed up but it, it didn't seem to suffer very long at least. It was the longest minute of my life and I guarantee you it was the longest minute of that rabbit's life. And I suffered. I cried for like three days straight. Oh my God. And it's, it, I kept it until I made sure it had no owner and I put alerts out there because it was an all black rabbit bigger than my cat is and it was huge. So, um, it was so soft, amazing, amazing bunny, and had little, it was all black, and but its little like tootsies had like socks on them. It had like little brown socks. It was black with little brown like slippers. Oh my God, I loved it. I, I, I'm gonna cry if I think about it. That poor baby. It's buried in my backyard. And me and Zero, cause she's the only one that will accept going out on the harness. Phoenix does not like to. We go out and every time we go out to the backyard, I put a stone on the little bunny's grave. So. The little bunny has about, um, I don't even know. I mean, this was de in the dead of winter that this happened. So I haven't been outside a whole lot, but I put, the there's a good bit of stones on that bunny's grave. It's at least a quarter of the way covered. And like I said, I buried, I don't like to bury animals in a tight grave. I couldn't even put the, I couldn't even put the, I couldn't dig a hole and put dirt over something's face. Oh, that fucked me up so bad. I've never had to do that. I've done that to my, my, a couple of my babies, a few babies in my life, you know? <laughs> my Bengal kitty, Rez, he had a whole ass funeral. 
He had a whole funeral by a lake with lanterns at 10 p.m. with multiple people. He had grave diggers because I was such a mess. But I just, I, I sincerely hate putting, digging a hole, putting them in, and then putting dirt over their face. I couldn't do it. That's the last thing I ever cover up if I bury something is their face because it just kills me. And, oh, baby bunny almost just did it to me again. I can't do it. Why, baby bunnies? Why are you doing this to me? I live on these back roads. Hold on. Oh, here you go. So sometimes it gets a little harsh. Mostly, a lot of times it's squirrels. But a baby bunny just tried to do one of those, like, I'm across the road. But then I'm across again, like, five times in different directions while you're trying to swerve and figure out which way to avoid running me over type shit. And it's, it's very scary. I had a flashback, honestly, right now. I'm just trying to help myself. I don't even know if anybody will see this, but I'm just trying to help myself because what the fuck? I always feel so bad for that poor black rabbit. He was so special and somebody told me that he even had like some babies with a wild rabbit. So, I mean, I'm glad his little genetics are out there because, whoa, look at this. Look at these deer deers. Hi, deer deers. Oh, <laughs> he took the fuck off. Hold on, watch. Dear dears, what are you guys doing, huh? Hi, dears. I love you. Have a good night. Have a good night. Get away from the road. Yes, move out of here. Yes. Okay, I saved the dears. I don't know if anybody saw that. I'm saving them all tonight. <laughs> Gotta save them all. Oh my god! What if they ran out? <laughs> Hold on. Shit. I just realized I gotta turn right up here. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. Okay, hold on. Well, let me make sure. Let's make sure. I'm gonna scare them into the hay bales. I know where the hay bells are, so don't worry about it. I'm very smart about my approach. Dear bees, dear bees. Oh, they're in the hay bells. It's fine, it's fine. They're in the hay bells. Hi babies, how you doing? <laughs> they're so cute. They just be chilling. It's straight up midnight. <laughs> I love deer sometimes. Oh, they crack me up. They just all be chilling in a gang at midnight. <laughs> I love them. Who be in a gang at midnight? Next to like me at Sheets with a sandwich. <laughs> and the rest of the people that love our um, sheets food for some reason we're all there always in the same days I mean of course if you have a certain schedule you're bound to run into the same people every day but it certainly cracks me up whenever I see the same people every time I don't know why especially when it's late at night oh baby kitty on my porch <gasps> hi baby kitty I got a heated house for the babies now. I got an extra large heated house from K&H. I don't know if you can look that up or not. But, um, it's a really good brand, actually. 
it surprisingly stuck together with Velcro, but it fit very well. Hold on. Yes, I'm driving. And I'm driving this time, I know. Wow, shocking. But I drive a lot, actually. Um, they fit very well together, the K&H houses. You can get them on Chewy.com. And they are heated. They plug into an outside, um, you know, thing. But they also, whenever I, uh, or whenever I, whenever a cat goes and lays on it, the um, heating pad, oh, I forgot I had all this whiz -biz back here. I forgot I had all this shiz -biz. oh my god. I forgot I got sandwiches. Anyway, I got sandwiches and chips. And I got a bottle of wine. Man, Past Maddie is amazing. You gotta love Past Madison. <laughs> I love Past Madison a lot. She does a lot of stuff that's super helpful for me, you know? She is just one of those true queens. She's like the savior of me. <laughs> In the future. Oh, my finger. I do that every time. Do you ever open your, like, um, your screen door and throw it open and your finger's stuck in it and you just break your finger backwards? Oh, shit, where's my house key? Hold on. What is this? this is like, over here. It's a cactus. See? Wait, no. Can you see Oh, never mind. Change. Oh, hi. It's me. I know. I'm sorry. I didn't know I was going to be gone for so long. Oh, you little squeaker. Little squeaker, what are you doing? She likes to stretch and she goes, do it again. Stretch. Stretch on the door and go, meh. <laughs> Here you go. You know the door? The door? Squeaker? Little squeaker. Come on, little squeaker. Meow, meow. Me, meow. Come on. Aww. Sorry, me, meow. We're not going outside. I just wanted you to squeak. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Anyway. I'll leave you this as a final, like, parting shot. One of my lights is out. Yes, I only keep... What? I have a big pimple. For a second, I almost said, <laughs> I almost said, <laughs> zero, what did I almost say? Zero, what did I say? Say it. She said, twat? That's what I almost said, twat? <laughs> Am I lying home? Oh. She agreed. I'm a lying hole. Anyway, it doesn't matter. But that's my key. It's a cactus. That's my house key. It's a happy cactus. And then my calendar is also this. February has been very confusing for everybody. Especially me. <laughs> is it still February? Oh, okay, it is. It's not a leap year. It was? 